All right, this is slightly unusual <laughs> yeah. for, for us. Once again, we have owner of Las Vegas Coin Company, John Jankowski, in the studio, and he's here to turn the tables on us. Wow, the interviewers have now become the interviewees, dun, dun, as dun. John has brought his own set of questions for us. We do not know what these questions are, so I don't know, I'm a little scared. <laughs> a, a little? Unfortunately, <laughs> I had to put this through Channel 13 management. And legal. <laughs> <laughs> and legal. But I always thought it'd be fun to interview you guys. Okay. Wow. Elliot, I'm going to bounce the first one to you. Oh, all right. Okay. It's not a bad question. Okay. Really. I'm sure it's, I'm sure these are <laughs> great questions. Uh, well, I don't know if they're great or not, but it was the best I could do on short notice. <laughs> what was your first job? Oh, my goodness. Mm. My, fir uh, my now, first. I don't mean in broadcasting. Just first, first job, job? Just ever. Wow. Uh, like most, like most teenagers that were looking to find some money to earn some pocket money, uh, it was like in, in bars and restaurants. Okay. Busting tables. What was the very first one, though? The very, very first one was probably Burger King. Okay. Shout wow. out Burger King. You know, you, you, <laughs> you know, know I got it. Yeah. I mean, that was I, honestly, I got it through a, fr a friend at school who was like, they're looking to hire. Do you want to come work with me and, and the rest of our friends? I was like, absolutely. Some of the some of the best times I had. <laughs> We're working at Burger King. I, I would probably say this in my memoirs. There were some despicable things we got up to behind the scenes, which I, I don't want Burger King to know about. But super, yeah, it was my, my first job uh, working Very in a nice. Burger King. And was that in the UK or here? That was in the UK. Wow. Okay. At Stansted Airport. Shout oh, out Stansted nice. Airport, too. <laughs> wow, what nice. times that takes me back. I, I, Thanks, John. I was, I was curious. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Jessica. Oh, boy, yeah. <laughs> oh, now I'm relaxed. Over to you. Well, I got to give her a chance. Yeah, of course. I don't want somebody to monopolize the camera. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> so, so this is a takedown. This okay. is an interview. Okay. Yes, it is. Wow. I understand you. You moonlight as a singer. Okay. I did know that. Yes. Okay. You're also. You're very kind. Oh, thank you. And so, are you more nervous singing in a lounge or being on live TV? Oh, wow! Great question. Um. Well. <laughs> I'm like staring at the camera. How am I not go kind? Hmm. Why do you, why does kind get reserved well, for it's you? It's not about you yet, Elliot. Hold on. So, okay, so, um, singing. Do I get more nervous singing, or do I get? I, you know, what's strange. I, I don't really get nervous. I get for both. I get butterflies of excitement. I think the only time that either of these positions, whether I'm singing or whether I'm on camera, is usually if I feel any sort of slight unpreparedness. That would be the only time that would create a little sense of like, oh, do, do I have this? Am I okay here? But as far as like going up on stage or being on the couch and doing my thing, I love it. I don't really have like a okay. nerve feeling, yeah. Have you ever had a notable fail? Um, ever or in ever. regards to, uh, oh, notable in, in, fail. In your, in your profession. In my profession. I don't want this to sound like conceited no. but no I mean I, I you know there are in conversations and in anything else like with different types of you know songs I do I think when we're in these positions you you know okay I wanted to say it a certain way yeah. or sing it a certain okay. way or you know but usually viewers or the audience watching a performance doesn't really know that that you move changed. along yeah so, and then you block it out yeah well I've had some horrid fails here on the blend well, <laughs> last question Elliot yeah what is some? What is one of your favorite possessions? We talk about Ooh. possessions Ooh. all the time Ooh. here on the blend, at least as it relates to Las Vegas Coin Company. You've been in our store. Yeah. What I is one of your favorite possessions? You have it on Man. your desk. Uh, there's, there's a gift from you. I certainly. That's a, that's a prized possession. We won't talk about that. That's nope. that's that's to be shared just between us. I, honestly, I you know I don't I don't put a huge amount of value in 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 physical things. You know, uh, prized possessions for me are like memories, time with my family, Aww. my kids. Seriously though, yeah, my you know time with my wife and my my I say my kids, which are my dogs. That, uh, as in like you know that's not really possession though. But honestly, you know what, John? This is one of my prized possessions. I would like to say. Oh, you missed my watch. I was hey, wondering where I watch when. We were looking. <laughs> For that all morning. My, you know, my, my run of the mill everyday three thousand dollar watch. <laughs> yes, that I like to wear. The, this happens to be John's. I should probably give this back to you. But yeah, probably yeah. yeah. Oh but man! Yeah. Well, that was yeah, fun, that John. Thank you. This went really. way too quick. I know. It was fun. I know. We could do this all day. Doing our job right here. <laughs> well, you can find John at ninety five fifty five Southeastern Avenue. The address and phone number are right there on your screen as well.